How Expert! Top 10 Burlesque Dancing Tips How Expert publishes quick how-to guides on all topics from A to Z by everyday experts. Visit howexpert.com to learn more. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more How Expert Top 10 videos in the future. Moving on, let's talk about the How Expert Top 10 Burlesque Dancing Tips. Number 10. Do some research. Starting burlesque can easily feel overwhelming. Find what it is you like about burlesque. Is it the old school glamour or the new style of burlesque? Will your act be sexy, funny, or somewhere in between? What kind of performers and acts are you drawn to? And why do you want to do burlesque? This will help you decide what kind of an act you want to develop. Number nine, pick a song. Music will really set the tone of your number. The perfect piece of music will get you excited about your number and committed to following through. A slow, sultry song will be perfect for a slow burn strip tease. A faster instrumental can be just right for some funny storytelling. Both modern and vintage songs are acceptable. There are even numbers to classical pieces and spoken word poetry. Get creative and listen to a wide variety of music. There are countless playlists of classical burlesque music to serve as a starting off point, but don't feel boxed in. Nothing is off limits, so find what inspires you. Number eight, pick a costume. Once you've picked a song, you can start brainstorming what kind of costume you would like. How long is your song and how many pieces of clothing would you like to remove? Try not to start with a very long song your first time around. Keep it short and simple and focus on developing your style. Decide whether you will make your costume yourself or purchase. Don't get too hung up on how fancy your costume is. You're just starting your journey and there's always time to add embellishments or upgrade pieces. Number seven, choreography. Time to start choreographing your routine. You can always pay a professional to choreograph a routine for you but don't be intimidated by doing it yourself. Start by listening to the song on repeat and thinking about your costume. Picture the points in the song that would be good for reveals, paying special attention to changes in pace and volume. Get up and move to the music. Maybe practice with a pair of gloves or a simple piece to remove. Start at the beginning and build your moves piece by piece. There's no need to rush. Take your time to build your great number. Number six, don't stress. It's easy to look at the world of burlesque and feel completely overwhelmed with the glamorous professionals making it look effortless. I promise you, it is not effortless. And even Dita Von Teese didn't start out as Dita Von Teese. Everyone has a starting point and it is rarely at the top. Give yourself a pat on the back for trying something new, exciting, and empowering. Take a step back and remind yourself that there is no perfect timeline, and whatever pace you're working at is fine. Develop your act in your own time and enjoy the process. Number five, practice. There's a reason this saying is practice makes perfect. While there are some gigs that might call for improvising, most you will need to bring your own polished acts. You're going to spend a lot of time on this choreography and you don't want to forget it. Start by rehearsing the moves without costume, committing the motions to memory. After you feel confident in the foundation, start rehearsing in the costume. You may find a move you had in mind doesn't work in practice for removing an item. Simply adjust and try again. Lots can change when adding the element of costume, but it's often for the better. Number four. Pick a name. The vast majority of performers choose to perform under a stage name. A stage persona can help you connect with your inner showgirl and tell the audience something about you. Look at the names of some of the performers you researched and look for inspiration. Names can be anything from funny puns or historical references to childhood pets. Have fun with it. Also, remember that your name can change. You may find your name doesn't fit the performer you eventually become, and that's okay. Find what suits you best. Number three, for yourself or for show. 
a misconception about burlesque is that it has to be done in public. This is not so. Burlesque can be just as fulfilling when done solo as in a packed house. Maybe you feel like you're not quite ready to show the world what you're working with. That's completely fine. Work your new skills with your partner or gather a group of friends for a burlesque-themed night in. Burlesque is meant to empower you, so do it wherever you feel comfortable. If diving feet first and seeking out a show is what you want, then go for it. Number two, know your local burlesque scene. Getting to know your local burlesque performers is a crucial and fun part of getting involved in burlesque, especially if you're hoping to perform with them. Being present in your burlesque community before you start performing can show producers you're serious about the art. Attend all the shows you can, get to know the different groups, and see if one most closely mirrors your style. Ask the show organizer if they need volunteers. Shows are a lot of work, and extra hands are often appreciated. They may even require you to spend time volunteering before you get on stage, so be curious and available. Number one, do it. Getting started is often the hardest part, but no time like the present. These steps will help you feel less overwhelmed and simplify the process, so don't be scared. The burlesque community is a welcoming, warm group of people full of information and help. Don't hesitate to ask performers for advice or guidance. Some groups may even offer classes. Keep an open mind and just give it your best try. No one's burlesque journey is the same, but it starts somewhere. Find a stage, get on it, and keep going. You'll be living your showgirl dreams soon. If you liked our video, be sure to click like and subscribe for more How Expert Top 10 videos for all topics from A to Z in the future. Also, let us know what other topics that you want us to do a How Expert Top 10 video in the future in the comments below. Thank you. Have an amazing day and take care. How Expert publishes quick how-to guides on all topics from A to Z by everyday experts. Visit howexpert.com to learn more.